Hello and welcome to another episode of Warcraft 3. This is going to be the first episode of the campaigns on the Reforged graphics. So we completed all of the base campaigns on the classic graphics. We did not do the Founding of Duratar, but uh, I will be doing that on the Reforged. It is time to commit the sacrilege that is switching to Reforged graphics. Terrible, I know. Absolutely terrible. But uh, I do want to play through it because I never have, actually. Um, so I want to see what all the different models, Tychondrias, Farimothras, I want to see Kill Jaden. I want to see all of them in uh, their, re -re or their reforged glory. And then afterwards, I want to play the re-reforged. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, this series will mostly be uploading on Wednesdays and Thursdays. There might be a few schedule changes here and there where I upload more or less, depending upon you know, kind of how things work. I will be playing this on the hard difficulty. I will include all the cinematics and all the cutscenes, even though you guys saw that in my old playthrough for uh, the classic graphics. I just think it's fun to have them. I think a few of them have been redone, like the teaser for Warcraft 3 was redone. Maybe we'll get to see that for Exodus of the Horde, hopefully, but I don't know. And uh, afterwards, we'll be playing a bunch of custom campaigns. So uh, if you want to see a specific campaign, let me know in the comments below. Anyways, let's get started. We're going to play this on hard because I'm sadomasochistic. I, I really am tempted to just play this on normal, breeze through it, not have to care. This is going to force me to have to save and restart and all that stuff. But I think if I'm ever going to play this on hard, it's going to be now. So let's do it. The sands of time have run out, son of Duratan. The cries of war echo upon the winds. The remnants of the past scar the land. Once again, by conflict. to challenge fate and lead their brethren to battle. As mortal armies rush blindly towards their doom, the burning shadow comes to consume us all. must rally the Horde and lead your people to their destiny. That is such a cool cinematic. Like the cinematics for this game are great. I do wish they redid, I think, the trailer cinematic into the uh, Reforged. I thought we would see that before this one, but there must be some way of finding it. I'm not sure why. You can just look it up on YouTube. 
I think it's a real shame that they did not redo all the cinematics, just like visually kept the same audio, kept the same story beats, but it would have at least slightly justified the increased price because the rest of the game is the same. Uh, anyways, chapter one, Chasing Visions. Somewhere in the Arathi Highlands, Thrall, the young war chief of the Orcish Horde, wakes from his troubling dream. What kind of nightmare was that? It was not a nightmare, young war chief, but a vision. Follow me, and I will reveal what your future holds. I don't know what this is all about, but I'll play along. I'm debating whether to talk or not during the cutscenes. Um, I didn't during the regular. Mm. This is him. Excellent. This is Thrall. You seem eager to be on your way. <laughs> oh, uh, However, the you sensitivity is a bit high. Give orders to Thrall. Try ordering Thrall to move down the path towards the nearby banner. To do this, click the move button in the bottom right corner of your screen yeah, yeah, and shut then up, click shut on up. the banner. We'll just head to the next thing so he'll stop talking and then we can uh, select. Very good. Yeah, shut up. The path um, to the next banner leads Notice through. how the black area shrinks as Thrall moves through it. This reflects areas you have explored. Look at that prancing. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Jumping up and down. Tar, my warriors. These are the grunts. We are yours to command, War Chief. I do not like this, the, the dead space together, between them. Maybe there is a setting that removes them. that. Let's get I really don't game. like that. Uh, let me know in the comments if you know how to get rid of these or how to have the the box when the dialogue comes, because I, I like those. Are all selected. Order them to move mm. to the next banner. Prepare yourselves. I sense a knoll ahead. Check out this To knoll. order Thrall's forces to defeat this foul creature, Select all of your troops, oh. click on the attack button, and then click on the knoll. Hmm, this was only a scout, but the knoll's yeah, yeah, yeah. just a, ahead. A move, a move. Order your troops to perform an aggressive attack move into the enemy encampment. The knolls look this, cool. Select all of your troops, click the attack button, and then left click on the ground in the middle of the knoll camp. Let's get oh, on. Oh, we're really zoomed out. I'm gonna have to deal a bit with the, uh... Camera settings, can I do that now? Menu, options, can I do that? Gameplay, no, I cannot max this. I wanna reduce that to like 2000. Okay, well, I'll have to deal with the camera settings later. The null huts, they look a bit fancier than I thought they would. Good job. Notice that Thrall gained a level from the experience yeah, that I he know. earned in combat. For that's honor. cool, these look a lot cooler. The, the spells, yeah, that's nice. Master. The grunts. I am the war chief. Look at that wolf, boy. Yeah, uh, I'm debating whether I should talk or not during the cutscenes to give my opinion of character models, or if I should just talk afterwards. Yes. On one hand, I kind of want to be quiet so that you guys can just For listen to honor. the cutscenes unabated. On the flip side, I want to be able to give my opinions, yes. and there are so many playthroughs of this already. War chief. We've discovered a group of Murloc raiders in the nearby river. The Murlocs would make excellent targets for your new chain lightning spell. To have Thrall use his new ability, click on the chain lightning yes. button. Some monsters drop treasure when they are defeated. Treasure chests hold powerful magic. This items. particular treasure chest contained a useful potion of mana. Notice that the potion now occupies one of Thrall's inventory slots near the bottom middle of your screen. Potions of mana can be used to replenish a hero's mana, the magic energies that allow the casting of spells such as chain I mean, it is very pretty, I will say that. Let's use the chain lightning. Why not, right? And then I think there's far sight, right? Thrall is currently low on mana. Use the potion of nope. mana to We're refresh definitely Thrall not doing and that. provide him with sufficient mana to cast additional spells. We should get into night time right now. Yeah, there is a path this way. I think there's a tome or something here. Maybe, maybe not. Not the sure. Wolf howl signifies that night has begun. Oh my god. Be wary, my warriors. Don't let nightfall dull Potion your senses. Potion of healing. I'll take it. For honor. I guess we have to head 
this way. Yeah. Hmm. We are gonna kill the ogre. For honor. An ogre. We'd have a fierce battle on our hands if the beast weren't sleeping. So this is kind of where I want to play it. I think that's pretty good. So look at that. None will survive. Huh? Looks pretty cool. Time for killing. I think I, I will be quiet during the cutscenes. I, yeah, I, I will. I will for the most part. Yes. Uh, part of me wants to just blabber on and give my opinions about story beats and stuff. But on the other hand, for honor. the game is so good and... Dabu. I, I do have the whole playthrough mm. with the classic graphics, so you can watch yes. it there, but I don't want to force anyone to have to golem. watch something watch else. Watch yourselves, my brethren. Those creatures do not sleep at night. What? Don't golem. Hopefully, yeah, there is a uh, tome or something that we can get. What is interesting with the Reforged is that the no. uh, game, it may not be so anymore, yes. but the Reef Reign of Chaos, what they did is they standardized it. Look so the Reign of Chaos, you have 100 supply instead of 90, and you could have multiple items in one slot, and that made the campaign quite easy. It basically trivialized mm. it. The item thing wasn't as want? big of a deal, oh no but problem. the uh, awesome. 10 extra supply is massive. I mean, imagine you Excellent. have like... Thrall has found a magic 12 ring. supply worth Rings of workers, and that means you only have, what, 28 as as supply care. before you get into low upkeep. Having Being able to have an extra 10, that's 38 supply. That's basically an increase of 33%, yes. something along those lines. It, it's a massive change. I mean, if you have two expansions, that's 10 workers, that's 10 supply. Well, let's say you have lumber for that. So that's, let's say, six, five workers on lumber. So that's 15 supply. That leaves you with 25, so 35, yeah, that's, what, 40% more? Is my math correct there? Yes. It's a big deal. Let's check out the trolls. Forest trolls. I still can't believe they were ever a part of the horde. How do I do the camera rotation? Is it, yeah, okay, there we go. There we go. That's pretty cool. The models are a bit, especially when you zoom out that much, but they're a bit meh, I'm not gonna lie. Like they're, it kind of fades into the background. The ground is so rich and then their colors are slightly muted. I don't know. It's not terrible. We'll see what it looks like when we actually have big armies fighting. We shall see. The war chief. Yes. I should disable the mouse scroll, honestly. It's a, a, cl a crutch. The Ooh, manual of health. Restless. Thank you. Very good. Very the treasure good. treasure chest held a magic tome that can be used to give Thrall a permanent benefit. Amazing. Now, what is interesting for the Reforge is that they included, for the expansion, they included, uh, I, don't, I don't, there might have been before, but they definitely uh, either created or had custom campaigns so you could download custom campaigns and what they also did is they created the three missions that were between thrall's trip to the sea to kalimdor and him meeting the dark spirit tribe and for reforge they've included them all into the base campaign so you cannot access them anymore with the classic graphics i don't think but we will be playing them with the reforge so there'll be five missions for the orcs instead of three which i think is kind of fun the prophet not loving his portrait but he's fine he's okay Let's Thrall looks great greeting son of duratan i knew you'd find your way it was you i saw in the vision who are you how do you know me i know many things young war chief about you and your people my identity at this time is unimportant. What is important is that you rally your people and leave these shores immediately. Leave? What's this all about, human? Human? <laughs> I left my humanity behind long ago. I am something different now. Know that I have seen the future and beheld the great burning shadow that is coming to consume this world. You sense it as well, don't you? The demons are returning. 
Yes, and only by leading your people across the sea to the distant lands of Kalimdor will you have a chance to stand against them. But how can we- I will answer all of your questions in time, young war chief. For now, rally your warriors and prepare to leave this land. We will speak again. None of this makes sense. But the spirits tell me that I should trust him. Alright, so that was the campaign mission, the first one. We took it pretty slow. Ten minutes is very slow. I also talked a bunch and we watched the cutscenes. I'm guessing the episode's going to be like 14 or 15 minutes long. That's an interesting thing is how stable will the... Uh, oh, is this the... Yeah, let's watch that, the prophecy. This is the, uh, the Reforge cinematic. Maybe I should have <laughs> shown this one first, but it's fine. We never paid any heed to the ancient prophecies. Like fools, we clung to the old hatreds. And fought as we had for generations. And now, upon the brink of destruction, for the reign of chaos has come at last. See, that's pretty cool. Like, I like that. That is a cool introduction. It's weird that they didn't show that at the start. Um, I wish they'd done that for every cinematic, honestly. There's one cinematic here. There are two cinematics for the human campaign. There is one cinematic for the undead one, one for the orc one, one for the night elf one. So just that would have been, what, four additional, five additional ones? Like, it wouldn't have been that bad, like, honestly. Shelling out $60, they could have done that, in my opinion. It would have been cool. It would have been cool, but it will. Uh, yeah, <laughs> this episode is way longer than the 10 minutes it took to, to play through it, but yeah, it is what it is. Uh, I'm going to mess around a bit with my camera settings. Hopefully, it'll be better. I will start Chapter 2 tomorrow. I upload content every day of the week. Warcraft 3 on Wednesdays and Thursdays will be the usual schedule. Every now and then, as I said previously, it might differ more or less, depending upon scenario but yeah it's gonna be fun playing through it once again on hard hopefully i'll do a slightly better job we'll see if the uh reign of chaos is way easier or if they did increase the difficulty i think they rebalanced some things so they made it a bit harder but not sure if they uh, did and it will give us something to compare to when we play the Re reforged campaign which i think is really cool uh but yeah subscribe and i'll see you guys next time take care